now know two Christmas tree shops on Cape Cod are on the chopping block. Days after we learned that the chain filed for bankruptcy, we now know the locations, including one in Falmouth. And as WBZ's Julie McDonald shows us, the list also includes one of the most iconic locations in New England. I can't believe they would actually close this one because this one stands out from all the rest. The iconic windmill warmly waves hello and goodbye to passing traffic over the Sagamore Bridge. And customers of the Christmas tree shops can't believe the Sagamore spot is on the short list in the Chapter 11 bankruptcy filing. With the thatched roof, are you kidding? This is lovely. We love to come to this store. So I don't want it to go away. It isn't just the charming appearance of this Sagamore store, but its location. For many people, just the sight of it right beside the bridge is tied to treasured memories of Cape vacations. Definitely like one of the, oh, there's the Christmas tree shop, like we're almost there type thing. When I was a kid, we would go down to Truro and stay at a campground every summer for like two weeks. And on the way back, my mom would be like, well, we got to stop. And we'd always find something to buy. The nearby Falmouth store was also listed in the store closing agreement filed Sunday in court. More than a dozen other locations in Massachusetts seem to have been spared. Regulars hate the idea of a world with fewer Christmas tree shops. Don't you just love a bargain? Pained by the thought of the windmill's days winding down. It would be a shame, you know, it's part of the cape. In Sagamore, Julie McDonald, WBZ News. Wow. A lot of memories there. And here's the question. With a building like that that's so memorable, what can you put in there after the Christmas tree shop? I'm not sure. Right? Ooh, we'll find out.